What's up guys, welcome back. Uh, I know I haven't uploaded in a few days, so sorry about that, but a brand new part three of the Halloween update dropped today, and it hasn't even been an hour, and I literally got everything already, so uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty dope. Um, but before we tell you how to do everything, I would appreciate if you join the Discord, I will be providing a VIP server for you to use as long as you use the rules given, and uh, make sure to sub. So join the Discord, sub, and uh, let's get into it. So first, before we start covering everything like trick-or-treaters and all that new stuff, I want to pretty much tell you guys how the quest works. So simply, you just have to run around the map looking for the... Uh, the the little tombstones you just want to run around the map find all the tombstones and uh every five minutes five of these ghosts will spawn across them so only five of them will have ghosts every five minutes you just click them and you get 25 points meaning about 125 points per five minutes uh pretty easy i'd say considering i already finished the entire event um but yeah, it's pretty easy. Just do that. Um, the best way to grind this quest is just have a friend help you out with finding them and then take turns on who gets to collect them. So I'm doing this with Haley, um, and she helped me find them. She would tell me where they are, and then I would grab them until I did it, and now we're going to help her find the ghost she needs so that's pretty much how this whole thing works it's the best way to do it you it's better than grinding alone uh just do it with someone you can trust i guess but uh yeah otherwise that's pretty much it for the quest um two new candy items dropped we have the grand wafer i love those wafer cookies by the way they are delicious i eat those a lot um and we have the cookie nader. So we have we have some pretty cool items uh this update, I'd say. Um we have I, I I'd say we have some pretty good items. They they aren't perfect, but they they are definitely definitely pretty dope. I do appreciate the cookie theme here. Cause uh I'm tired of seeing candy. I, I I want some cookies, dude. I don't know about you. I'm a cookie person more than a candy person, but that's just me. Haley making fun of me for liking, uh, cookies. I know. I have, like, a cookie obsession. Don't worry about it. Alright, I should probably shut the hell up about my cookie obsession and get on with the video because nobody found that interesting and I already know that. So, let's continue with this. So, uh, pretty much there's this new item called the rock. I'm gonna teach you how to get five of them in a minute here, but, uh, it's a cool upgrader. Looks pretty dope. I'm not really too big of a fan, um, but it's all right. There is a new item here. Um, pretty much this thing uh, is pretty cool, uh, in my opinion. But, you know, pretty much useless. Then uh, Potted Pumpkin came uh, into the collection, too. So pretty dope. I like it, personally. Might be able to do some cool stuff with that, um, decoration-wise, so... I don't know, we'll see. Um, this is one of the new items, so is this. This is by far my favorite item in the whole update yet. It, I just love the coloring on the pumpkin. Um, the infuser is also really bad, I don't recommend you use it. It's just genuinely not that good. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you guys tell me what you think of these items for yourself, so. Oh, so the ores just get stuck, I guess. Oh no, they just die. Okay, that's that's dope. I I I love that. Great item, ten out of ten. Or is literally just die the second they go in. All right, and then we have this. Oh oh shit, that's actually dope as hell. Like splits the ore in half, and then it kills it sometimes. I, I'd say it's alright, but I, I don't think I'm going to be using this, to be honest with you. Um, just just my personal preference. I'm not really into items like that. Alright, uh, lastly, I'm going to go over all of the locations for the um, trick-or-treaters and 
five of them will award you the rock. So let's get into that. First off, we have the um we have the giant buff noob guy over here, right off of spawn. Click him, and you will get a rock. There is another by Sporist, um, which is over here. Uh, you could find him right here, and I think he gives you, like, a pumpkin box or something. Only five of them give, uh, the rock. To the right of the, uh, Sporist, we have the chicken dude. He will give you something as well. Then over by the um the, the the gate thingy, uh let me find it really quick. Alright, yeah, right over here, um by the I think this is the blue pumpkin. Oh, there's literally no color on this. Alright, uh basically just the one right to the ship. The door here. I swear to god, I've never seen the black pumpkin. I literally thought they all had colors. I'm just stupid. Um, There is a T-posing dude on top of the ship. So, uh, we are gonna go over there, grab that really quick. Right up here. Um, what else do we have? Oh yeah, we have the dude by the campfire. Which you can find right over here. Then we have Tower Dog. Um, is what Haley calls it, so. Yeah, it's right here. It's up on the tree. And then inside of the tower, you could find... Uh, the one robot-looking dude. You just click him. I'm pretty sure he gives you a hundred candy or something like that. Then there is the hot dog, uh, dude at the tower in the middle of the map. Right here. There is a dude at the Sporist. We're gonna go to the Sporist and get his. Alright, so it's right here by the, uh, the gate, as you can see. This was the gate used for the second quest, so you guys will probably be familiar with that. Alright, though, uh, alright noobs, uh, we are gonna go find... Any last ones? Uh, I'm pretty sure that's it. That's the end of our list that we've kept, so... Yeah, also, Haley, there's a ghost literally on the left side outside of this forest. Um, also, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, all of these items are pretty basic. I am gonna do a review really quick for the rock. Also, um, I don't think it adds candy value, but... Someone says it does. I don't think it does. Uh, basic. But let's let's give this boyo a test. Oh yeah, I think it actually might add candy. It might. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, swineite. Wait, first we gotta first we gotta do this the legit way. Alright, so conveyor. And then uh let's use candy factory. Alright. Alright, so that was worth one candy. Now, let's try it with this. It does add candy! Alright. So, it does add candy. That is confirmed. But, um... 
yeah, otherwise, it's pretty dope. Uh, good update. I enjoyed it. I do wish it was a little bit longer, but that's probably just me. Uh, again, join the Discord down below, and uh, y'all take care. See you in the next one. Peace.